Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are having an amazing day today. I am super excited for today's video because we are getting so much done. We're going to be undecorating my Halloween decor and giving everything a nice good scrub down, getting everything nice and clean, clearing some things out, decluttering some areas, basically getting the house ready for the holiday season. So tomorrow will be my Thanksgiving decor and prep video. And next Wednesday, we'll start my Christmas decor videos. I'm so excited for that. If it was up to me, my whole house would be Christmas right now, but I host Thanksgiving here. So I like to decorate for Thanksgiving in my dining room and kitchen. Anyways, that's besides the point. But if you love decor like I do, then make sure to press the subscribe button and make sure your notifications are turned on. That way you get notified every time I post and you won't miss any new videos. Before we get into this cleaning video, I just wanted to say that today's video is also really exciting because it's in collab with my friend Whitney. I'm going to leave her channel and her video down below. Whitney and I collabed together like two years ago and since then I've just related to her so much and I always go to her channel when I need some motivation to start cleaning. She has the best cleaning videos and she's super transparent with anxiety and how difficult mama life can be and I can just appreciate that so much when people are open and honest about the real life stuff. You guys will seriously love her channel so make sure to check it out after you're done here. But anyway, we are just starting off by undecorating the whole house. I'm starting off on my hutch because that is where the majority of the decor is. And what I like to do when I'm undecorating is just pile everything onto my dining room table. This makes the packing away process so much easier because I put everything in piles. So like all of my signs go in piles and glass items that have to be wrapped up, everything like that, just so it's super easy to see everything and pack it away a little bit more organized, I guess. Although my decor is not organized at all packed away like let's be honest my basement is a mess but i'm trying i'm trying to get a little bit better at organizing it Dreamy, breezy, we go. If you are coming from Whitney's channel or if you just happened to stumble across this video, I just wanted to take a second to say hi and welcome and introduce myself. My name's Tristina and I'm a 24 year old stay at home mom to two little boys. I post YouTube videos two to three times a week to help try and inspire and motivate you guys as well as inspire and motivate myself. It's crazy how just taking camera out gives me so much more motivation to get things done rather than doing it on a day-to-day -day basis. Speaking of one of my sons, there's my youngest one crawling into the kitchen to find me. Um, but if you guys enjoy the mommy lifestyle homemaker type content, it would mean the world to me if you'd press the subscribe button, become part of my YouTube family, and also introduce yourself in the comments down below because that's something I really love about YouTube is getting to interact with you guys and getting to know you. I'm flying over the clouds And I'm not coming down Every time we touch I feel at home Oh, 
Okay, so it's officially time to pack away the Halloween decor. I just wanted to show you guys kind of what I do when I pile everything up on the table. Um, I like to put glass kind of together so I know what I have to wrap up. I put things together that I know I need Ziploc bags for to throw those in just to make it like a little bit easier. Um, and then like signs I'll put together, basically just to try and make the packing process easier. Now over here is my bins. <laughs> I bought two new bins because my Halloween decor was in those white bins over there. But um, I have a bunch of fall decor in there now in my fall decor. I don't even know where that was, if we're being honest, because I have like no fall decor bin. So I don't know what happened. Maybe my summer decor went into them. I don't know. But And then I've also always had this one big orange and black one, which I tried to find more of this year. So they matched, but I couldn't. Um, and that one actually has all fall stuff that's going to be coming back out. That will be on a That will be in a video on Friday. So tomorrow, actually, I'm going to be doing a... Thanksgiving decorate with me for you guys so stay tuned for that if you want to see the fall come back out but more into a Thanksgiving feel.
Now that everything is officially packed up, I'm gonna go ahead and start wiping everything down and getting the house clean. I'm also wiping down walls and things like that, basically just wherever those bats were. <laughs> they leave behind like a sticky residue and wherever signs are that I'm took down and plan on putting like a new one up that might not be the same shape, I wanna make sure to get any dust or anything that was behind the signs before replacing with new ones for the Thanksgiving decor. And I'm also going to give my hutch a good wipe down as well as underneath my hutch because I don't move my hutch out too often and it's probably something that needs to happen more regularly. So we're gonna do that in today's video as well. Let me know in the comments down below if you decorate for Thanksgiving as well or if you go straight to Christmas. I'm genuinely curious and if you're somebody who decorates for Thanksgiving then I hope to see you here again tomorrow for tomorrow's Thanksgiving decor video. Um, but also if you don't decorate for Thanksgiving then make sure to come back tomorrow as well because at the end of the video I'm gonna be sharing with you kind of my tips on how I start to prepare for hosting Thanksgiving and everything like that. But one thing I really love about Thanksgiving and especially hosting is that it makes it so I have to clean areas in my house that I don't clean quite as often. So in the upcoming weeks, I'm gonna have a lot more cleaning videos with more like in-depth deep cleaning going on. So I am looking forward to getting that done as well as sharing that with you guys. <music> heartbreaking for me but we are gonna pack away some of the baby items in this video make more room for the holiday season we have out his jumper and his walker and his swing he can still use this walker and the jumper but he honestly just doesn't he's a baby that likes to roam free he doesn't really like to get put contained and things like that so and a swing he's too big for so we're gonna pack those up and put them in the basement my nine month old almost a year old I'm crying Seriously, is there anything more heartbreaking than packing away the baby items? <laughs> it's so sad because, you know, you realize that they're not using them anymore, but at the same time, it frees up so much space that I almost forgot that we had. <laughs> However, I pack all my stuff away in our basement and basically I just put a trash bag on top of like the fabric part and I don't think that this is the most effective way to store items. We're trying to keep things for the next baby. So if you have a more effective way, then please let me know in the comments down below because most of the stuff doesn't fit in bins. Even if I like break it down, it doesn't fit in bins. So let me know how you store baby items if you also hold on to them for each baby that you plan on having. <laughs>
recently I posted a video where I went through all of my kitchen cupboards and decluttered everything with you guys and organized them, but things like that <laughs> don't last long for me. I end up getting lazy and just shoving things in, as you can see, under my sink area here. So I'm just going through and reorganizing everything really quick because there's nothing more frustrating than when you're cleaning all the time and you can't find your cleaning supplies and stuff like that, especially with... Um, Again, Thanksgiving coming up, I want this to be organized under here. So if somebody needs to grab like paper towels or whatever it may be, they can just open it and find it easily instead of having to look through whatever this is. If you made it this far and you've been here a while, then you already know what's coming. <laughs> if you made it this far, you're an MVP around here. I appreciate you so much. And to let me know that you made it this far, leave the, oh my goodness, I always struggle thinking of an emoji on the spot, the pizza emoji down below. So I know that you made it this far and I can tell you that I appreciate you because truly you guys watching and supporting my channel means so much to me more than you'll ever know. And I really genuinely do appreciate you all so much. guys whose house even is this it is so incredibly bare in my house right now <laughs> it's so strange ignore um the laundry room over there but oh my gosh it's so bare in here i am ready to get some decor in anyways i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i hope you got some motivation from it we got the house completely ready for decor to go back up. So come back for tomorrow's video. I'll be doing a Thanksgiving decorate with me and next Wednesday will be my very first Christmas decorate with me. I am looking forward to that one. Truly wishing I could do my whole house because it just like, just gives you all the feels, you know? 2020 has been a weird year. I would love to put up all my Christmas decor, but I do host Thanksgiving and in the spirit of Thanksgiving, I want to keep some turkeys up and you know make it feel like thanksgiving on thanksgiving and not make it feel like 
Christmas on Thanksgiving. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to check out Whitney's video. Again, it'll be linked down below. She's amazing. You guys will love her. I can't wait to watch her video. I get so much motivation from her. Like every single time I clean, I go and click on one of her videos. <laughs> Thank you, Whitney, for collabing with me. It means so much to me. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in my next video. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.